Well, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. This is Kusan, and we are on or hovering above America Island. This fascinating island is a replica, an exact replica of the United States of America. With, you can check the city names, all the cities are there. If your city's not there, I do apologize. Alright, Hawaii is not a city, alright, I do apologize about that as well. All right. However, even the geographical features of this land are very similar to, well, America. There's a west coast, and there's an east coast, and there's, uh, there's a river, Mississippi River. In fact, that's our current mega project, but in this episode, we're going to pause on that because, well, because there's other things to do, and also, we need a lot of money to continue this project. I sort of... I sort of left the game on play by accident and then came back to 300 million and that was pretty much enough to bring us up to here a little bit past Washington which means that we're gonna need to make 300 million dollars plus alright so what what can we do to help us make money well first of all I don't really feel like pausing this game too much uh, we're just gonna keep playing see if we can't make it to the 1960s. It's 1959 right now. The 1960s would be good, definitely. Right. The reason I'm hovering about above Las Vegas here and uh, San well, Los Angeles is because I think that this could be a quick fix that could bring us in some money. This train here, the LAX People Mover, is a money money loser, and it's quite important to our economy. First of all, we have. Uh, People come into the airport from here. In fact, they're, they're, they've come. They, they've already come. They're waiting around. They're waiting for more planes. Perfect. However, what else can we do here? Well, straighten out the track, you silly fool. Why, why do you have such a curvy track? I don't. I don't know. Alright, let's do it. Uh, high speed? Yeah, high speed. Yeah, that's, I'm going with high speed. Are you... Uh, does this station reach that airport? Could you maybe make this a multimodal station? Oh, don't you love multimodal stations? Never again, though. Never. N no more episodes shall ever have a multimodal station. Well, how, how are we going to do this? Uh, we're going to test it out by putting a track. It should be faster. I, I got rid of ships. Oh, there it is. Track. Platform. Where is that? That's in the menu that doesn't even say platform. Platform. Alright, passenger building. At the very tip of the edge, maybe. The LAX terminal. Yeah, the further out you can get it, the better it is, I suppose. Oh! You, you messed that up, because there's not a platform on the other side. Good, bravo. Bravo you. Good job. Good job you. But definitely this will reach, I think. Uh, if you just do it correctly, it will reach... Yup. Is that, is that a yup? It is, it is a yup. So, I'll be back in two seconds, because this requires upgrading, of course. Alright, I've done it. No time to waste. Basically, I put a... Well, you see what I've done. Don't need to explain it. Unless you need me to explain it, but I won't. So, let's keep going here. I don't think this here is going to land perfectly, is it? It's going to align perfectly. Wowza! Is that perfect? Let's see. One platform plus one platform. No, there's an extra track right there wrecking it for all of us. But we're not going to notice, are we? We're just going to pretend like that's perfect. Uh, don't you worry. We can upgrade this in no time. Absolutely no time over here. Electrify and... I could have done this originally. I don't know why I didn't do this. Not to worry, though. Not to worry. Ooh, you better reconnect this to the road system, because cause the trains are coming, and uh, you've got to, you know, provide them with some sort of access. Uh, okay, provide them with access. Don't just, don't just look for nice road patterns. Yeah, that's a nice road pattern. That also provides access. That's best of both worlds. Okay, come on, sir. You, you know you know what you gotta do. You need a little landing zone over here. Right, that's not gonna cut it, is it? Nope, it's not gonna cut it. Put it 
Nope. Put it. Nope. Come on. Right there. Nope. Right there. Nope. What's wrong with you, bro? Oh, you're getting stuck on the factory. That's strange. Don't you get stuck on the factory, please? Okay, start from this end here. Why not? Alright, you're giving me this much room. No, you're not giving me any room. Fine, fine, fine. We'll just build a straight up rope to this side. Nobody's going to complain about that. I, well, at least I'm not going to complain about it. It's straight. Hurry up, the trains are coming. I hear a train. Alright, hopefully this actually unloads, because if it doesn't, I'll be pretty, pretty, pretty disappointed. It's, a, it's, it's waiting for its ore here. Yeah, excellent, we got the ore in. Now it's time to make start making some steel, please. Right, next is this train who's waiting. Unfortunately, he chose the wrong piece of track to wait on, so we're gonna have to give him because we're on we're on play right here, aren't we? Uh, how are we gonna do this? Just go a bit this way. This is a temporary track. I'm so nice to these people, building them temporary track and all. Right, you can go here, then do a nice U-turn. Oh, that's a sharp U-turn. No, it's not going to let you do that, is it? Are we going around? Yeah, we're going around. Uh, that This is temporary, folks. Don't you worry. This is how you build stuff on play. Very, very ugly. Ooh, why don't we just uh, connect this station up here? Because you, I don't know. Because you're procrastinating, maybe? Are you procrastinating? Hmm, collision, eh? Now, of course, there's a whole thing with LAX having, like, roundabouts and everything. I don't know if we'll ever get to that. Would be nice. It would be nice. But at the moment, we have something a little more simple. Well, I'll tell you what. I'll tell you what. We will build them a roundabout. Are you now? Yeah, I am. Okay, how are you going to do that? Uh, put this guy in the air. No, that's that's clearly not a roundabout. Nope, it's not. You're right. Well, it's because we have this temporary piece of track, which no longer has any purpose. We'll, we'll hold up some passengers in Las Vegas. You've been stuck in the gambling capital of the world, so have some fun, please, would you? Yeah, thank you. Excellent. So, which uh, roundabout are you talking about? Yeah, this station doesn't even need to exist. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, that's good thinking. Yep, 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 yep. Unfortunately, maybe they do need to uh, act. There are planes landing. We are trying to make money, so... Right, everything's temporary slash permanent. Well, we'll have to see. What do you mean we'll have to see? I don't know. Um, we're, we're working on it. We're trying to be efficient. It's causing us some some havoc and headache here. This is temporary as well. And you're gonna need a temporary U-turn. Oh, this one's this one's gonna be permanent. This one is we'll give you the full 180 meters of track to speed up. <laughs> By the time you switch tracks, you're halfway there. Ah, great planning, Kusan. That was that's you can't beat that kind of planning. So I'm picturing, let's see, oh, you gotta switch platforms as well. How would you do that? You would go there, say Terminal 3, and beg that they chose the right one. Yeah, you chose the right one. Now go to the line. Mr. La Mr. Train? Where are you, Mr. Train? No path. I don't believe you. Manage line? Yep. Las Vegas to LAX, and then Los Angeles to LAX, which is also a cargo terminal, which is very inaccurate. Now I hope nobody's laughing at the fact that we have high speed track on one side and then the sharpest turn on the other. I mean, what you gonna do, eh? What are you gonna do? Right, part two of this project was to um, bring some oil into this station Really? Yeah. Or no, 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 no. Bring the oil out the train this way. 
Okay, so then why didn't you give them a through track here? Because, you know, that would cause a lot of havoc, wouldn't it? Yep. This is our oil train coming in through here. I mean, in a way, it would be easier to just smack down a new station right beside it. However, that's not going to be good planning now, is it? Oh, oh, idea. I have an idea. We can always have another track on this side. All right. All right. Let's do this the official way. Which is building under a bridge. That's the, uh, yeah, that's the official way. Why don't you go here? And you go here. Come on. Oh, we're, we're encountering some lag issues. We're making this car stop. Don't you worry, you can keep driving. Yeah, they're all stopping there. Not all of them, but most of them. Some of them. And yeah, none of them. But now, watch this, they're gonna stop again. Oh, are you gonna stop now? I mean, not lag, I mean an official stop. Oh, this guy stopped. Good, th thank you. Stop for the rail crossing. Interesting. Alright, so over here, if I keep it flat, which it tells me it's flat, but I don't believe it. It, it tells me this is flat. That's not believable either, is it? Alright, we're gonna have to do something... We're gonna have to do something silly here, aren't we? Right, you, were, you were good two seconds ago. I don't know what happened. Bring you back here. What height are you at? You are at the pretty much proper height. We just keep going this way till we reach the end of the mm, until we reach a flat stance. That's a flat stance. Yes, it is. And keep going until you reach something a little more flat on this side. Now, I don't generally, I don't generally like trains ex changing their slope beside a station. That's, that's ridiculous. That's also ridiculous. Alright, if I bring you a further out, does that make it look better? Yeah, that, that actually is not bad. Not too bad, at least. So, you're back on the oil line here. I've got a signal placed there pretty much incorrectly. How's that? Uh, you actually have some kind of speed diminution right there. 74, eh? Alright, uh, we're not going to complain about 74 miles per hour. Uh, we are going to complain about this tunnel a bit. But at least we got the approach, right? We got the approach, now we need a parallel tunnel with a merge. Uh, yeah, it's interesting, very interesting. Oh, you're not liking that either. Oh, I know. Just bring it a little bit further back there and it should be good. 70? Hmm. Maybe over here. So we're at, we're at uh, May 15th, 1956. We haven't moved much in terms of time, but we are at 100 million. So clearly what we're doing is making sense to someone. Meanwhile, we are fixing long overdue problems. This this here, I didn't... You know what, though? I mean, if you look at these lines here... Uh, let's look at them from the official line manager. Zoom out a bit. Trains. I mean, can someone please explain to me what went on when this was built? Because you've got a train coming in, jumping across this platform, and then jumping across that track again. I mean, I know I built this over various epochs, we could say, but, I mean, we made it work. We definitely made it work. Oh, by the way, when you guys weren't looking, which was between episodes, I actually managed these train lines a bit and made sure they all got their own platforms. Like, in this case, the tools train has to stop here, but the lumber train doesn't, so I gave it this side of the platform. No big change, there was already a... There was already a platform for cargo on this side, and other than a few signals that I placed, I just made sure that 
pretty much at all times, where is it? Pretty much at all times, there's only two trains sharing a track. Now, I wasn't sure if it'd work. I mean, this guy is waiting, but he's an empty train, right? What is he waiting for? He's waiting for a full train. So that, to me, sounds pretty good. In this case, yeah, the, the, the coal train has to go around a... Uh, sorry, the ore train has to go around the coal train as it loads up, because that takes time. And then we have the coal and ore train sharing the middle track. We have the oil train out there, and then the tool and lumber train working together on their outer tracks. So that's, that's decent. I would have to say that's decent. Or maybe I'd say that's half decent. Ah, look at our cute little trucks over here, hauling lumber. Or rather, logs. Alright, get back to work, you. Back to work. Alright, so over here, what are we doing here? Uh, we're, we're glad the bridge did not complain. This bridge did not have to be rebuilt in live time. You're telling me that this needs another platform. No, it actually doesn't. Oh. Well, that's good news. Are we going to do a sort of terrible roundabout? Ooh, yeah, we're going to island hop. This is the name of the game. People people on YouTube have been island hopping like crazy, and I haven't even considered it. Because we're America Island. We don't have islands. We're just America on an island. Uh, I do like my straight piece of track. Right, some, something... Uh, I do like a curved piece of track, though, too, sometimes. But how curvy are we going to let it go? This here could be pretty straight. Change change to pretty straight here. No, you have to curve a lot there. Well, you know what? We're going to have to curve a lot, then. I'm going to grab this guy here. He unloads on that platform. So we'll build sort of like a... Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. We have, a, we have a train here that is going to cause us problems. Let's deal with this side first, the passenger side of things, just to know where the train will go. I hope I'm not, I hope I'm not causing traffic. Oh no, this fella has been waiting here since a long time. Right. I have paused the game because, well no, you know what, we're not going to pause the game, but see for yourself what's about to happen here. We're going to start building on, on my territory. Can we get 186 high speed? <laughs> probably not. Probably not. You don't need this bridge, Las Vegas. You do not need that bridge. Alright, so bridge demolition does take a bit of time. Very, very sorry about that. Right, what's the what's the optimal? Let's check an optimal route here. That's the optimal. You're not even gonna give me a speed check? Alright, demolish this fellow for six hundred thousand. Just don't rebuild it. Don't rebuild it. Don't rebuild it. There, 87, 89. Whoops. Checking another bridge here. Up to 9900 miles per hour. Okay. Okay, we don't lack bridges that are over top of water though, do we? No, we're terraforming again. Uh, I do apologize. All right, we're gonna we're gonna fix this up here. We're gonna give Las Vegas some room to grow, as I like to call it. This is room to grow. Slash room to build our railway. Uh, this this one's not as expensive though as our our project up in the Mississippi and Bayou re regions. Okay, I hear a plane. Oh, don't worry about that though. It's just a plane. There he is. Excellent. Why don't we get this guy going where he wants to go? Now that that to me can can this be avoided a bit? Nah, you got yourself into a pretty serious situation. However, you are showing above 90 miles an hour throughout the whole length of this track, so what is this going to be here? If I go here, it's 90. 
Right, what we need to do here is demolish this station. We're gonna let this guy go with a temporary piece of track. Don't you panic. Right, go ahead, you. You're, f you're free to go. And on the way back, oh, you're gonna go back on the same track, are you? Being smart about it. Well, at least now we know we can build our oil line, I guess, on a bridge? Because this guy's flat. Okay, no need to hide in the trees. It's not that frightening of a project. Let's go. No catenary. What I would love to have is a... Do you know what? We don't actually need this depot. I thought that we'd build the, the harbor up to here, but you know, it doesn't even make sense. What we can do is put two regulatory pieces of track. These guys are going to be our regulation of height tracks. Yeah, but, 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 but you're building a bridge, aren't you? Yeah, I'm building a bridge. Oh, you built too many tracks. You're gonna build too many tracks. Alright, uh, calm down. We're gonna live. So we'll connect it up to here, temporarily. I know what I'm doing. I know what I'm doing. It just gives it that straight elevation change. Perfect. Now this guy will do a merge. Uh, and also I witness, over here, I witness some missing piece of track that's going to cause tons of havoc in the future if I don't fix it right now. Alright, this guy doesn't want to merge at a proper speed. Alright, what if I give you one of those? There you are. There you go, fella. You are happy now. And so am I. Alright. Now up here, I will permit elevation change. However, can we get it in a slight degree? In a sort of a slight elevation change? Where are we heading anyway? There. Alright. There goes our people mover. I'm sure our airport's backed up like... Now, I'm wondering if this, if we're going to get away with this. Quite honestly, I don't think so. But it's worth a try. 45,000, build it. Yeah, we're going to get away with it. I just need a bit of a... I just saw us get away with it for a second and then not too much. Try again. Nah, uh, you're not going to work with me here, are you? However... Let's just check the speed of this rail. Are we getting the right angle here? 54. Yeah, it needs to be a bit wider. Even that's a bit too, uh, too sharp. Right, well, this guy's heading up. That's good. This guy, I mean this track. This track is heading up. This here speed, let's see, a speed check, please. Why don't we just uh, cross it at level level crossing? Now that that's that's not smart. All right, well this works for me. Although uh, it's only 184,000 approved, approved. Now don't worry, this is just a template. We have to rebuild it because this game. Oh, this game! This game makes you build everything twice, which makes this game last twice as long. Ah, uh, they do not like demolishing bridges. Not one bit. Maybe it would be smarter to not even have this, uh... Right, you're, you're pretty right. You probably should have just had to go on a bridge the whole way through. Nobody would have minded that. Okay, build something here, like straight-ish. A straight bridge, because that's what I'm going for. Straight bridge means uh, make sure it's straight before you build it. Yeah. All right, you kind of got that wrong. It needs to go where these trees are. All right. This here gets rid of all the trees, which tells me it's the perfect height. I think on the other side is a bit higher of elevation on the other coast, but we'll, we'll see. Now, a curvy bridge makes my... It grinds my gears. Don't curve the bridge. 
don't have a choice. I don't have a choice. I'm trying to keep top speed here. Nobody's going to mind if you curve the bridge. Plus, you need to curve up to there. Ah, what are you doing here? You are being smart about it by staying pretty level. Who's against this? Who's against that? Okay, who's against this? Uh, this is a temporary piece of bridge. <laughs> Once again. I want the shortest distance of bridge possible, cause, not because of money. I've already spent three times as much money on this little project than I should have. However, you know what, we'll, we'll play on top speed, even though that's going to make, that's going to cause us one major headache, isn't it? Right. And anyway, you kind of need to upgrade this bridge in the first place. So I said he'd be happy to go here, so... You'd be happy to go there, eh? Yep. What bridge are you going to be? You're going to be... Ah, the classic Transport Fever 2 What Grid Bridge. Gird, girder? Grid? Gird? McGriddle. Yeah, that's the one. Now, hopefully I got this curve right. Because it's not... Yeah, maybe one of these. What's the speed here? 75 going throughout. You build a little pile of soil. Can we get the soil down a bit? Alright, this one I'll approve here. What's going on here? There's a bump in the road, and then you go down, only to go up. Alright, who invented that? Who invented this part of the bridge? What about here? Are we, are we raising elevation while we're crossing the river? I would never approve of such a thin thing. Right, okay. Just a little bit of more rebuild and we're good to go. Yeah, don't worry, I, I, I do have a plan. I'm not just fooling around here. First of all, terraforming. That's the first word of the day. That's always the first word of every day. And you need a little bit of a peninsula here. And voila. Voila your peninsula. Ah, oh, come on. Well, that should do. Smooth? Yeah, smooth a bit. Yeah, they would love you if you smoothed it. Perfect. Next. Next up. Now, I'm confused. Why we have a rusty bridge on this side and a brand new bridge over there, I cannot tell you. Probably to keep those tourists going to Las Vegas appeased. And that, to me, passes the flatness test which is an official test that we do here. All right, let's keep going. Yeah. And we're at 150 million and we are not even past the first year. Guys, how do we get, how do we make this time go faster? I'll change the speed up to one half. It was at one fourth, strange. All right, I will permit a tunnel. What is this, a bridge or a tunnel? You, you gotta decide. It's a bridge and a tunnel. Okay, why don't you pile up some dirt for me here? Perfect. That's what I like to see. And... Well, you know, there's always potential for us to rebuild this piece. I mean, like, this here rock could just move a bit to the left and we'd be happy. I don't know what you're doing here. You're raising it out of the ocean. Ah, okay, that doesn't bother me too much. I'm just gonna have to smooth it down. Yeah, how about that? Didn't think I'd be smoothing things after raising them. Uh, that's what we do here. Tucson Gaming. As you can tell, I'm pretty stressed about being efficient here, and, well, you know, I'm not actually that, I'm not stressed, I'm having fun, this is a game. I'm just telling you that for some reason, this game has just decided to take the time in every respect. Upgrading stations, terraforming, demolishing bridges, everything takes one to two seconds and it, it adds up. It adds up. Yeah, Rusty Bridge. We're going for the Rusty Bridge over here. Uh, I'm sure an engineer would call this 
you know, something else, cast iron maybe, but I'm calling it the Rusty Bridge. Alright, so far so good. I think the viewers would love this. This is what they come for, for Tropical uh, Transport Fever. And I am in no way doing this to appease anyone, I'm just uh, doing this for myself. However, it just happens to be that we're going to have a nice jungle line here. If you thought that this was a nature and fauna reserve, you're now being proven wrong. Okay, can we get some straight track here? Because that's my favorite kind of track. Straight and straight elevation. Yes. Thank you. Thank you, kind people of the jungle. Alright, that one's a bit more... That one's a bit more elevated. How about here? Yeah, like a little tunnel might do. I've warmed up to tunnels, I'll have you know. I watched a, a thing on YouTube. I went on a train from, from Oslo to Bergen. I didn't do the whole thing, but it was like a four hour uh, video. Actually, it was a live stream, and what happened is this train in Norway just went through every single tunnel, uh, mountain in its way. Every kind of tunnel you can imagine, they had it. You know, I think I can get away with a bit more straight track on this side. What do you say? Yeah, straight crossing over here. Yeah, so basically this train in Norway, and then that way we don't even have we don't have a tunnel. Oh no, my whole story doesn't even make sense anymore. I'm gonna tell you about tunnels in Norway. Okay, the point of the the moral of the story really was they had curved tunnels. Their tunnels would curve left, right. They didn't care. So uh, you know, I believe in curved tunnels, but I don't believe in curved bridges. I, don't, I mean, I don't believe they exist, I'm telling you, I just don't believe it. And every single YouTuber out there who's building curved bridges needs to be shut down, because that's, that's not, that's not nice. That's just not nice. Now, if you want a curved bridge, in fact, a curved stone bridge, there is, I did, I did mention this in one of my episodes, I, I saw one, uh, Scotland has a curved stone bridge, so they do exist, but unless you're playing a Scotland series, this is America Island. We don't build curved bridges. Okay, calm down, Kuzan. You're ranting. You're ranting about the curvature of bridges, and nobody cares. Well, I care, and in, in the future, when I'm 99 years old, watching this video, I'll be I'll be glad I stood up for the straight bridges and the uh, the Scottish I don't know independence. I'm gonna move to Scotland after this. Just joking. Wow. You guys take me too seriously. Uh, Alright, what do you say we put it here? I say you've, you've pretty much mission complete. Ooh, look, a bear. A bear. This bear is the one I rode on the first episode. I did ride a bear on the first episode. Here he is. We're coming to town. You better get out of here because uh, we're going to build a railway through your habitat here. Which apparently is, a, is the jungle. Did you know bears live in the jungle? I'm gonna tell your professor that. Sorry, I had to downgrade this track. It was bothering me a bit. Yeah, no more high speed. It wasn't even high speed. You, you upgraded it. Nah, no, whatever. Right, is this 75 miles per hour? It is, it is. Is it perfect curvature? It could be better. We're going to give this a little bit more of a straight attack. No, we're not. We're going to go from here. Alright, this vehicle is available. Don't know what it is. Some kind of, looks like a diesel, two-sided, parallel, symmetrical. That's what it looks like to me. Now, if I, if I remember correctly, we have to go on this side. You're willing to bet, aren't you? You're, we are willing to build all the way till you get there. Well, hopefully they'll let us build it in one go. We're coming over here. And you guessed correctly. What do I win? I don't know. Money. You win you win money. Oh that's a sight to see for all you other YouTubers who love parallel bridges. You should just build one of those. I am so sorry, I'm not actually <laughs> I am not actually, uh, what's the word, calling out other YouTubers for their misbehavior. You may do as you please, to be quite honest. We're just having fun here. 
Alright, this here will stay parallel. Thank you. Thank you, Tropical Habitat. It's just you have to have a certain amount of ranting when you build these things, because what else am I going to talk about? Uh, uh, I'm going to talk about... Um, this track is 75 miles per hour. This track is 75 miles per hour. Yeah, no, nobody wants to hear that. But I'll have you know, the whole length of this track is 75 miles per hour. I will have you know that. Oh, except that's... Okay, Kusan. This piece is not 75 miles per hour. You're fired. How's, how's uh, the people mover doing? Is it making us any more money? You know what? If I look at the fi finances... Yep, nope, 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 nope. It's doing bad. It's always doing bad. Alright, give us two minutes here to demolish a piece of bridge, please. Just need two minutes. Now, I, I, I don't know. I, I'm going to rebuild the whole bridge. Because it's going to give us nicer uh, trusses. Yep. Engineering with Kusan as well. I don't even know. Ah, uh, here we are. Press M once. Hit on the M key. Give the, the passengers a nice white bridge to go under. Yeah, that we yes, we like this. We love this actually. This oil train is never gonna know what hit it. It's getting pretty much a doubling of its length. I am extremely excited about this. And just the whole area here. Alright, by the way. Do we need it by the way? Yeah, we kind of need it by the way. By the by, if you're wondering, am I going to build a loop around LAX type interchange that you'll find on GTA and in, you know, the real LA, I will, I will. But I'll wait for these airports to be uh, the upgraded type because it's going to take up more room. So there you go. That's an announcement. You can take it to the bank. What are we doing here? Oil train. Where are you at? There you are. The Los Angeles transfer, transfer, and station. You head on down to here. I hope I gave you enough platform. <laughs> oh boy. We didn't. We didn't check, did we? And we have amnesia when it comes to track length. We gave it 160. For some reason, I'm feeling that these stations have 200. Oh, they have way more than 160. What about what about uh, the, the oil terminus on this side? Oh, check, check, check. Oh, yeah, you're, you're right, Kusan. You miscalculated bigly. Well, that's not to worry. I'm going to do live configuration for you here. You better be patient. If you don't have patience in your soul, you're going to end up waiting one minute for this. Here. One, two, three, four, five, six, I would say. Six. Oh, you're going to have no place to put your cargo building. Uh, you know what? We do. Right on the ocean front. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you there. Uh, I don't know if we actually needed this. And I don't even think it covers the proper length. Oh, you, you built it on the wrong side. What are you doing? Right, don't worry, don't worry. Our engineers are on top of this. We, we got this. Make sure you put the right type of uh, platform. There you go. Thank you. We're going with the older platform on this one, even though we built it in the 1957. By the way, 1957. 200 million dollars in the bank. So probably next episode we will be uh, continuing our little Mississippi disaster project. I call it a disaster. It's really successful, actually. All right, 240 meters. The project is a success. It's just that uh, you know sometimes. Companies run out of resources and they have to postpone things. Fact. Right, what do we have here? 240. Ah, I'm surprised I didn't go with 320. Very surprised. But I'll stick to the 240 uh, custom. No worries. Now, if you if you think I'm going to be upgrading these stations... Oh, my trains are lagging bad. If you think I'm going to be upgrading any of these stations... For longer platforms, you are wrong. We are sticking with what we have now. Unfortunately, you didn't connect up that building. Ooh, that, thank you. You are being sweet to me there with a little a step. Let's give it a few steps because it's being so nice to us. One day you might regret building all those steps. You're going to have to demolish them. 
Nope. Nope, not me. Not I. Not I. I am not demolishing any more stations. This is perfection, what we have here. Alright. You did place that rock on one of your earlier episodes, so don't go demolishing it. Mm, yeah, you're not having it. You're not having it over here. What if I gave you a little bit of... Ooh. Ooh, we wrecked something bad here. Oh, nope. I don't know what just happened, or if anyone even saw that. You know what? We're not going to actually put this giant terminus here. It makes no sense. We need, we need room for a, a road there. I reckon something like that. Ooh, that has a road connection itself. And we'll give it a little, just a little hut over there to deal with this mountain slope. Excellent. Do we, do we want, do you want a road now? Would you have a road? I'm thinking you would, you're just going to complain about it a few times. Don't complain, this road is going to be nice, you know? You do know. Yeah, that, that looks good. There we go. Wheelchair accessible and everything. How many uh, cargo do we have here? 26. So what do you say we demolish this shipping line? Uh, it's a bit too risky to do that right now. You gotta put more oil trains on the line. You gotta put more signals on your route. That's for sure. Now, this is actually a pretty scenic route. But nobody lives down here. So nobody gets, only the train driver really gets to ride it. And again, here's another uh, fun fact for you. If you think that I'm going to be placing more cities in this episode, in this series, I think, uh, I'm a, unfortunately, I think our time is up for placing more cities. Because we have so much population right now that it's kind of uncontrollable. The lag is a bit, is catching up with us, I'll have you know. And a part of it is because you built monstrous mega stations, but part of it is just simply you put towns beside each other and everybody's driving between towns, like, uh, like about here. Oh, not too bad, not too bad. Let's go find an example of traffic. In case you were uh, worried that we don't have examples of that, we do. Here, oh! Oh, this is the, this is actually, it actually has a tram track on it as well, so. Like, can we ride this guy? Uh, actually, let's put it on a bit lower speed. I don't want it to lag. Got a bunch of glitching up here. I mean, it it is uh, scenic up here. I'll have you. I'll let. Oh my gosh! I just saw a Russian Lada car. I think it was a Miva or a Lada. There's a Russian car over there. Privately owned. Yeah, true. Um, what was I gonna have you know? Doesn't matter. You probably already know. Ooh, this is fun. This is like a roller coaster. Welcome to Roller Coaster Simulator Transport Fever. Uh, this is bad. No wonder. I was wondering why is this land not making us money anymore? It used to make us money. It doesn't make us money anymore because it has to deal with that. Okay, someone explain to me. Why is everyone going through Knoxville? Alright, next episode we're building a highway. Yep, yeah, I've decided. We're building a highway across the country, uh, I don't know where to where, but you know, it will do the job it's supposed to, which is across the country. I'm going to finish up here, and we're all going to have a fun time duplicating trains. No, we're not going to do that. I'll have to let you go soon. That's the truth. I can't keep upgrading stuff here indefinitely. We have to, uh, we do have to have intermediary parts of episodes. All right? Do you have a do you merge in there? No, there's no merge in there. Okay, we need that. Uh, I'm I'm trying out the uh, the good old merge from a tunnel to land. Like you know what I mean? Like between a tunnel and no, you have to do it completely underground. Construction not possible? I think I know why. Hold up, hold up. I know you don't have x-ray vision. 
completely. Uh, I mean, you might, but here. No, you're not having that. You're not having any of this. Uh, there's no other way to do this but going here and building it from there. Actually, I don't know how I'm going to build this piece. Ah, yeah, like that. There you are. Why don't we just merge it over here? Keep it simple. Nope, we're going to do it in the tunnel where we can't really see if it's causing traffic or anything. And the tunnel's not long enough. Alright, so we're not going to do it in the tunnel. We're going to do it after the tunnel. If you if you like having a lot of track next to a lot of track, this is the this is the show for you. This is where we put lots of track. There's four here and five there. So uh, yeah, um, it looks a bit glitchy to me here. Yeah, that looks better. Is it working? Yeah, it's working. Brilliant. So. I will, as promised, duplicate one train. Are any of these oil trains? No. Nope. Look at it go, though. It's not even lagging. I'm surprised. Usually after uh, an episode of hard work, things start to... Uh, trains start complaining. They, they are confused. They get really confused. What's this guy doing? He's doing uh, not too bad. Lumber train looks good. Ooh. That's not an oil train, I thought it was. Is he on the right track? He's on the right track. Good job. Right, is this our oil train? No. That's a tool train. Is it full? It is full. Oh wow, good. Super happy with that. No oil train to be found. Alright. I could just go into a menu, but I, I prefer doing the good old... Uh, and I don't even have the train icon open. There he is. Right, if I duplicate you, will you actually find a depot to be built in? Actually, you know what? This train is bringing 200 oil that way, so it seems to me like uh, it's gonna work. Now, I don't know, did I leave Las Vegas high and dry over here? A little bit. I didn't finish the whole point. The whole point of this, we were gonna upgrade the station, but. We're going to have to do that off camera because you know how it is with upgrading stations and stuff. Actually no, we keep the action going to the last moment here. We are definitely upgrading it right in front of you here. And hopefully, watch this, they're going to build roads right in front of me right now. Alright, I'm just trying to focus here and beat them to the, beat them to the punch here. What's the length here? 160? Alright, they built the road, doesn't matter. We can take one road. We can't do we can't do it if they start building buildings too. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to do that. Three buildings will be removed. Are you are you digging this into the ground? Yeah you are. Don't worry, don't worry. I think our settings are still saved there. So that's good. Right, I'm building it. 160, that's our decision. 240? Makes, it makes me happier a bit. Well, we're going to do 240 just because, uh, you know, uh, what's the reason for that? I don't know. Uh, I just, uh, I'm worried we're not going to build it long enough and then we're going to have too much problem. Okay, build it. Nice. Nice. You had to go and build it into the ground? Um, well, well. What can I say? That's not going to work, is it? Uh, it costs $2 million to do. Okay, in this case, I am going to pause. I don't want to spend $2 more million. They built this after I paused. I'm not even joking. All right, we're going to have to do... I think we're going to have to do 160. Now, you know what? That would be a mistake. Because that would be a big mistake. Um, yeah, 240 would be the correct length here. So if I just put you there, we end up in the same situation of a sunken building. What if I build you on the other side? Have you thought about that? Nope. I'll try it. Yeah, there you go. Are you sunken in? 
Sir? Sir, are you sunken in? Definitely, but uh, that's the that's the way we do it here in Las Vegas. <laughs> um, I don't know what to tell you. Maybe I'll just edit the building, but let's see, let's see if we can get a nice building in here. We sort of went with uh, five of these, three of these in a row, eh? Well, what we could do is just move the station this way. Which one is it? Is it this one or that one? It's a small end piece here. Right, so. Um, yeah, let's do it. Well, let's do it. I'm here now. You're here. We're here. We're all here. I mean, that looks better than the sunken in version, doesn't it? Yeah, a little. It's still a bit sunken in, but I can... 400,000... Anybody worried about 400,000? No, not me. Not me. So this is this is now the official station because it took us, you know, to make a good investment of money. So this has to be the the official station. You know what? Apply your terraforming techniques here. Uh, yeah, like this. There we go. Now, if the song ends before I finish the project, I'm going to have to just shut us down. So while we're here, I'm telling you goodbye. Thank you for watching. Uh, we had a lot of fun. Uh, we don't have to be on pause for this now. Yeah, we do, because they're going to build. You know what they're going to do. All right, well, this probably didn't fix anything, but... And the song's about to end. I can feel it. I can feel the song about to end. Well, you might have to come to next episode with a brand new station. You didn't see me build it, but you know what I'm doing. Press play. Thank you so much for watching. It has been Kusan.